Matt, I just wanted to say how much I loved your approach to yesterday's conversation, how open and vulnerable and honest you were. And so in that spirit, I wanted to continue adding to this conversation and hopefully in a meaningful and inspiring way to others. What is an artist? Are we artists because we have dedicated our lives to a passion and have chosen to follow a path where we can make a living doing it? That could be one viewpoint. But I think it's much deeper than that. I think that following the path of a creative, choosing to be an artist, means that you're choosing and are willing to look at the deepest parts of yourself, your light and your shadows, that you recognize that the art of creation is what makes our species so unique. And in fact, that being an artist allows us to tap into the deeper meaning of what human beings are and why we even exist. And that unlike any other species on this planet, we make choices each and every day in how we're going to spend our time, how we want to live our lives, who we want to spend it with, and what effect we want to have on this world. No other animal on this planet lives in that manner. They run by instinct and instinct alone. And while we can also run on instinct, our creative ability is what sets us apart. And so in that essence, every single human being is an artist, not just those who create art. But that is not always something we teach. And I truly believe that because we do not teach this, many people feel this internal void and they feel alone. What I have always felt and believed was that being an artist is actually an immense responsibility. Because as we journey into the depth of our souls, becoming more and more self-aware of who we are and how we are connected to everyone and everything around us, it then becomes our responsibility to share this knowledge with others, to help educate others, to help lift others up, and most importantly, to help remind everyone that at the end of the day, we are all one and we are all that we have. From my experience, many people from the outside see artists as people who decide to paint or play music for a living and often say things like, man, I wish I could do something like that. What a great life. And don't get me wrong, it is. But what most don't see is that by choosing to be an artist, we are taking on the responsibility of holding ourselves to the highest levels of accountability possible. And that is an extremely daunting task at times. Because after all, we are only human. But we also recognize that our humanity is what makes us so special and what allows us to touch people at the deepest depths of their souls through painting, through song, through our words. In this unprecedented time of such pain, such chaos, and such confusion, I think it becomes even more important, more of a responsibility of the artist to help lift his or her fellow human being up, to be the light. To any other artist that's listening, I hope we can all realize that we can inspire people to understand that they too are artists and that every single one of us has the ability to create an environment that allows everyone to shine and operate at the highest level possible. That, to me, is what a true artist embodies. Matt, I too am so grateful for our partnership and our friendship. It has helped me to realize better versions of myself, to communicate more openly and honestly, and more importantly, as we continue to mention, to inspire and remind everyone that community is really all that matters, that we are one, and that by being open and being vulnerable, we can create space for everyone to have honest, truthful conversations and Recognize that we can all lift each other up, even in the darkest of times. Matt, thank you for doing this. This was really powerful for me, and I can't tell you how much I appreciated your words and insight. And to anyone that's listening, I hope that we can help inspire you to help inspire others 
Because through love and through openness, there's nothing we can't do.